if you're not careful and you no clip out of reality in the wrong areas, you will end up in the back rooms, where it's nothing but the stink of old, moist carpet, the madness of mono yellow, the endless background noise of fluorescent lights at maximum humbuzz, and approximately 600 million square miles of randomly segmented empty rooms to be trapped in. God save you if you hear something wandering around nearby, because it sure as hell has heard you. Level 4. Abandoned Office. Survival Difficulty. Class 1. Safe. Secure. Minimal Entity Count. Level 4 is the fifth level of the back rooms. It is the level where almond water can be found most frequently. Description. Level 4 resembles an empty office building, though it is almost completely devoid of furniture. Some rooms on this level have windows, though most of them have been completely blacked out. Any windows that have not been blacked out are considered traps and should be avoided at all costs. Level 4 is mostly devoid of entities. Hounds and Dullers are the only ones to have been observed. One person claimed they saw a Smiler, but no evidence exists. Because of this lack of beings, there are lots of people on level 4. Scattered around this level, water coolers, vending machines, and fountains containing almond water can be found. Level 4 is very easy to escape from, and also return to. Level 4 is the best place to meet other people and find supplies. Before attempting to move on to the next levels, you should stock up on almond water. You will need it, especially in level 5 and level 6. Bases, outposts, and communities. MEG, aka the Major Explorer Group, Base Omega. This is the second main base of the MEG. This is where the other half of the group's teams live close to the entrance of level 5 and level 6. This base is heavily guarded. Amor Incrementum. This group is a religious cult who worships agriculture. This group is one of the smallest groups in the back rooms, having only around 10 members. The only plants they grew were various species of mold, harvested from walls in level 0 and level 1. They're incredibly hostile and not normally up for trade, unless you have religious objects, such as objects depicting Jesus or other religious entities, in which case, they most likely would be willing to trade. TBD, aka To Be Determined. The group likes to hoard various objects and items for themselves. The group is very small, with only six members. The group will ignore you unless you try to interact with them. They only trade for really strange objects, that don't really have a function. Entrances and Exits Entrances There are many ways to reach this level. Some of the most known ways are to no-clip into a wall in the hub. You can also get here from level 3 using the elevators, or by finding a door on level 2 that is unlocked. Falling through the pit in level 283 has the chance of teleporting divers through the ceiling of level 4. Exits Level 4 has occasional exits that lead to level 5 and level 6. Most exits take the form of office-style stairways, or occasional elevators, that may even lead back to level 3. As with almost all exits in the back rooms, once you lose a direct line of sight with it, it may disappear unexpectedly 